Hi guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new, welcome back if you're not. My name is Delaney and today is a Fashion Friday video. I do these every week on my channel. And for today's video, I'm gonna be doing a keep a return haul, which is one of my favorite types of videos to do. You guys seem to love them as well. And I have to say, the reason I wanted to do this particular haul is because when we were in New York City last month, we were shopping around and we stumbled into Free People. And Free People is a store that I, not a store, I should say a brand, because where I grew up, there is no Free People store. But it's a brand that I grew up loving. I've ordered it online since I was in high school. They carry them at Macy's, which I do have in my hometown. And I would always go shopping there with my grandma. And I just loved Free People. But over the years, I kind of fell off of my love for Free People. I felt like it was a little too bohemian and it didn't match my current style for the past couple of years but the other day when we were in there i loved so much stuff i felt like my love for free people was being invigorated i don't know if it's because my style is going back to a little bit more bohemian or if they have like updated their styles or a little mix of both i don't know what was going on but i was very impressed so i went ahead and i did a big online purchase and now we're gonna do a keep a return haul so we have this big box here and the way that I do these videos I will link everything in the description box for you guys and I will just kind of casually try these on I'm not gonna style them I'm just gonna share what my thought process was when I was picking them out and then kind of a little review on how I feel about the item and ultimately if I'm I'm gonna keep it or return it so the first piece I actually already took this out of the box because I was trying it on <laughs> earlier this is a little necklace which I'm sure you guys know, I've talked about it a ton on my channel already for like trend videos and stuff, but these kind of like applique type necklaces with these really big charms, especially flowers, have been huge this year. So, picked up this little one, obviously from Free People, and I think I like her. She's just a big, chunky black flower. I think when you wear something like this, you can't really wear your hair down because this is the moment. It's like very overpowering. So I feel almost like you need like a slick bun situation, some kind of slick hairstyle. But I think it could be a thing. Like for the holidays and stuff. I don't know. My other thought is that I don't have a long enough neck for this or something, or the flower is just literally too big. I don't know so I'm kind of like I do like this I really like this piece but maybe it's not right for me and I'm starting off with a 50 50 so that's not really how these should go but you guys let me know how you feel about this necklace All right, here is another accessory that I picked up likewise with the applique kind of statement necklaces also these skinny scarves are really big accessory trend for this year so I picked up this one that is kind of like a okay silver black meshy design i thought it was really fun i actually saw this in store and i absolutely love it i'm wearing like a very strange outfit right now i mean it's not that strange i'm just wearing randomly like sweat shorts and a blazer i have no idea why to be completely honest they're just things that i threw on at home that sounds so weird like why would you just wear this at home but i'm not even kidding but yeah i actually love this necklace like the or this scarf the weight and the material everything it's chef's kiss so we will be keeping her it's like picking up all the accessories right now because they're really small and kind of at the top of this box so next up is a headband i've actually been really into headbands lately this one is a chocolatey color which is honestly the color of the season and it's like a suede material it's nice and big and chunky she's cute I mean my hair is not really right for it right now but or like I wouldn't style it like this necessarily or like style the headband like this but I think she's cute she's nice nice quality so I'm, I'm gonna say keep because there's just a small little accessory you can throw on with so many things why why wouldn't I have this in my toolbox all right I kind of just like threw it all on my bed so I could see it a little bit better while I was going through it. I don't know what's going on with my hair. It's like so greasy right now. I tried to like re-blow dry it today. It's crazy. These ones look really fun. So these are the same top. I got it in black and in white. I saw this on the mannequin at the store and it's just like a little loofah fluff ball top. 
I thought that this is like the funnest thing ever for holiday and just kind of occasion so like going out date night I don't know my birthday is coming up it just it seems fun so let's try this on mm. okay I feel slightly ridiculous in this because it is slightly ridiculous but I also kind of love it like it truly is giving loofah like it's really poofing out and it was a little hard to get on it was a little like tight over my shoulders I think Ooh, I really don't like it like that. I feel like it needs to be off the shoulder only. But I kind of like it. I think it's fun. I think I envisioned one of these with this necklace. So it's only like this. It's kind of a vibe, right? I obviously didn't buckle it, but I think that's kind of fun. For the bottoms, what would I do? Probably just like black slacks with this and like a fun pointed toe heel. I think that this is a keeper. Like, I think that this is just too fun not to keep. I got it in a size small. I don't know if I mentioned that already. I'm going to try it on black, too. I don't think I need both. Let's see which one we like better. I really like the white because I feel like a little cloud, a little cherub on a cloud. Okay, also the black is a vibe. Oof. I don't know what color I like better. I kind of think I like the white better. The black is like nice and edgy though. I think this would also be a cute holiday outfit with like a high-waisted pleated silky skirt if you wanted to be like a little more whimsical and feminine, I guess, instead of the slacks. Black or white, you guys let me know. I'm keeping one of them. Probably a lot of people are gonna hate this top. I can just see it. They're gonna be like, you look so crazy in that. But I like it, so pick your poison, black or white for me. Okay, this next top, I think this is a workout top. Cause it has this little like design on it and it's giving workout vibes but also i don't really remember picking this out and i have no idea what i was thinking because i don't really like it at all and i just can't figure out what the vision was i need to go back on the website and see how this is styled on the model or something because usually that's like something in that will inspire me or like spark an idea and currently i have no idea what this was for so it's a return <laughs> We're going to try on some pants with it, though. So I picked up these green, kind of army green color cord trousers that look really cute and comfy. I'm thinking I probably was just going to wear these with, like, graphic tees and flannels, kind of laid-back vibes. Okay, I have these on, and I do think that they're cute. They're really comfy. I like the fit of them. They have some nice, like, detailing in the silhouette. Like the way that the legs flare and they have these little like pinches they're kind of like cargo-y um but i'm not obsessed with them i don't think i need them they're not like screaming obsessed so we're gonna pass next though we're gonna try on this little mini skirt that i picked up it's a little faux leather mini skirt I saw the black one of this in the store and it was so cute. I was obsessed with it, but they did not have it in my size and they did not have it in my size online. It was like sold out. So I was like, you know what? Next best thing is this color. And I got this in a size zero because I tried on the two at the store and it was still too big. And this is like pretty big for a zero, I would say. Like, so I think that this runs very big. Okay, you guys, I don't understand. This is still, like, too big on the waist, and it's a zero, and I'm, like, a 25. So there's definitely many adults who wear a size smaller than me, and this is just, it's still doing this this thing where it's, like, you can kind of see <laughs> down there, and then the back is, like, very loose, too. But I did love this because I just thought it was so cute and fun. It is obviously so micro. It's like a belt for a skirt, but it does have shorts underneath, so it's like not as sketchy as it looks. I still think the black color was way better. That's out of stock everywhere. And I just don't get why it needs to be like about this much tighter. And I don't even think I would normally get a zero. Like that should be a two, I think. So it's just a little wonky on the sizing. I think I'm gonna have to pass. While we're here, in this strange little outfit that I have going on. I got this little scarf hood situation, which would be so good for when we're up in the snow, like in Tahoe and stuff. I don't wanna like get makeup all over that. Is my face just like too big for this? I don't know. 
It's not working. It needs to go. That made me feel claustrophobic. I hope I didn't get makeup all over it. I didn't. Okay, I can't do that. That's not for me. It's a return. Whew, okay, I'm sweating getting this one on. But I picked up a couple of activewear pieces from Free People because I've seen a lot of girls on social media wearing their activewear and then I saw some in store and I was like, wow, they just know what they're doing with that kind of stuff. And if you follow me on Instagram, you probably know my love for one piece activewear. So that's what I got a lot of. So we're going to be trying all that on. Let me lower you a little. This one I got in an extra small. I think I got them all in an extra small because one thing I've noticed about one pieces is I really don't like when they have like extra fabric or are a little bit too loose. So I kind of sized down in them to an extra small. So they'll be a little bit tighter, especially like on the booby area for me. But this one is so cute. Look at the detail on the back. It has this little like cutout. The one thing I will say is because I'm a little bit on the shorter side, it is like extra fabric right here, which I don't love. I'm 5'4 for reference, and it fits really nicely. Um, it's kind of like a little split flare hem on the bottom. Like, it's just generally really cute and comfy, but I think this little like gap in the back is not it for me. It's not, it doesn't make the cut because of that. So if you're a little bit taller, I think that this would be perfect. That is blinding me. But for me, I think because of that, it just, you know, it's not working for me. That's how I feel. It's getting returned. These are like literally a workout to put on. This one is a little bit better. So I literally just ordered like four of these different one piece workout sets. I have to figure out how to get the girls to fit in here properly. Um, this one I like better though. It has less of an issue because there isn't fabric right here. So because it's open, it's not like posing an issue with my height as much. The back of it is also really nice again. It's a little bit more open and strappy. And then the girl situation is probably the worst fitting. Again, because I sized down to like an extra small. And so what's bothering me about this now, I don't even know if you can tell here, but there's these little like bits of fabric that are like sticking out on the side. I want them to be like fully flushed, but they're poking out, especially when my arms are down like that. It's like, ooh, that just might not be worth it to me. The hem on this is about the same as the last one. So it's kind of like a little split flare. It's so cute, super flattering and comfy. I just think this, Booby situation, which usually this does happen when I'm wearing something that just doesn't really fit my chest right. I don't know, it's such a small detail. I would love to keep it, but I don't think I can. She's getting returned, but not because she's not great, just fuller chested problems. If you know, you know. Okay, guys, this next one I literally hate. It makes me feel so weird. I don't know if this is navy or black, it's kind of looking like navy to me. It's like a seamless vibe. Okay, it's very different than the other ones. It makes me feel so strange, just look. It's giving like 70s vibes. The top is like a different material. It's all one piece, but the top is a different like ribbed material and it's a little bit thicker. And then the bottom is so thin. It's literally see-through and it's like, it's a cute silhouette, but it's also just weird. It looks so weird on me. Like I feel like, I don't know what it's doing that is so weird but it's just like a very interesting thing to put on it feels stranger than it looks probably that's why i said i hated it i'm sorry i didn't mean to be so dramatic but it's a return okay this is the last one of these and this one's actually a shorts version i need to pull this up way more i actually like this one a lot i think she's gonna be a keeper so it's long sleeve but then shorts See, the other thing that's a little bit tricky about this is like I like an extra small so that it's fully flushed everywhere, but then it gets a little tight on my legs and it's kind of turning them into little sausages. So that is something that does kind of bother me. The back of it is super cute. Again, they'll do these little, like, little details with the opening, which I think is so cute. I love anything with thumb holes, so definitely appreciate that. Really nice like scoop neck. This is giving ballerina vibes, which we love. So I do like this one. I got this in an extra small as well. What do you guys think? Is it cute? 
feel like it's really cute. I think I can get down with this one. I think it could be cute. And then because this is the last activewear thing I have, I also picked up a pair of shoes. And they're activewear shoes. So maybe we'll try them on with this. They're kind of like purpley blues. I do like them. I don't know if I need them. I feel like I need a really good pair of... I did those too tight. I need a really good pair of workout shoes. I need them to be like a more plain color. Which these are plainer than the ones that I have. The orange and yellow ones. But I, I want just like black and white. I saw a girl wearing an all black pair the other day. Which I don't love an all black shoe, so I don't know. But I do like these, but I just don't need another pair of bright workout shoes, so I'm gonna return them. Which I could have known from the time of ordering, but here I am. Okay, so I have two more things, and I'm literally sweating. This is a little bodysuit that I'm gonna try on. It's a sexy little velvet bodysuit, and then this is a polar opposite wholesome little ditzy floral jammy one piece thing so let's do those two and they'll be we'll be good kind of messed up my hair and my makeup putting this on the neck hole was very tight either i have a big head or it was very small and then i just randomly put these sweat shorts back on to see what this would be like with bottoms so obviously not these bottoms but this is really fun it has this like keyhole cut out oh with like a high neck, it's velvety, back is like completely open. I mean, I think this is fire. It has like a little bell sleeve situation too. This is, this is a hot top for a hot topic for the holidays. So yeah, this is a keep. I got it in a size small. Just do your makeup after you put it on would be my advice. Cause I even put my hair like over my face when I put it in, which is like a little trick that I'll use to put tops on once I have my makeup on, but I still messed up my makeup, so it's just a tight little top. Okay, and the last thing, we're just ending it with this little wholesome moment. Like I said, this is a little one piece. You guys see it all the way back here? It has a hood, and I like that it's not um, tapered. I feel like a lot of kind of like long john type things like this like a tapered fit and I feel like this is comfier and more flattering or just it's not really flattering because it is kind of just like a paper sack but it's comfier in my opinion than the tapered ones so yeah I feel like this is really cute I love that it has a hood I feel like it's just so comfy and wholesome like we love this for the holidays do I need this hmm. I might I don't have like like a lightweight i have like a one piece flannelly cozy thing but it's a lot hotter than this so this is nice for something a little bit more lightweight love the pattern it's cute for lounging i got it in size small for reference i don't know i'm kind of i'm leaning towards keep right now because it's just so cute all right but that is it for today's video hopefully you guys enjoyed this if there's other brands that you want to see me do a keeper return haul for you can always comment them down below i'll add them to my list also any other video suggestions that you guys have you can always comment them and i'll add them to my list as well so as always thank you guys for watching i really really appreciate it and i'll see you next time